Welcome back, Welcome everyone. Back. Welcome back. This is Unrelated Minds. This is Unrelated Minds. So, on Sunday, mm-hmm. I was watching a Rihanna concert, right? <laughs> and then for some reason, they started playing a, an, an American football game. No like, way. in the middle of nowhere. What? Turns out, that game was the Super Bowl. Oh, no way? <laughs> yeah. Oh, so, we're going to talk about the Super Bowl. And, okay. of course, since we're talking about Super Bowl, we have the expert. Dude, you should work, like, at a... Super Bowl conference. <laughs> like you should be like one of those TV what are they called? Pundits, right? Pundits. Pund- I've yeah, never heard the of TV that word. pundits. No. Like the ones that analyze the games and everything. Oh, but okay. okay. Anyways, yeah, we'll get into Rihanna's concert and that weird uh game that played in the middle of Rihanna's oh, yeah. concert. And uh happy belated Valentine's Day. Oh yeah. We are recording right. this Valentine's on Valentine's Day. Day. Pakevan, we have no days off. <laughs> we work every day of the week. 24 7 against our will I yes yeah. wait no <laughs> the podcast has us in chains we have to work yeah on the days we have said yeah. yeah and i mean pues las toxicas nos están esperando but they have to wait <laughs> Yo no tengo oh, una toxica. Liar. <laughs> Yo no tengo i'm just kidding i'm just kidding <laughs> <laughs> okay, stay I'm tuned just kidding. Welcome back. I'm Ezri. I am Asio. I'm Josue. And since it's Valentine's Day, everyone's <laughs> busy, right? Because mm-hmm. they're weak mm-hmm. and we're strong. Mm-hmm. So we are doing our podcast. And since everyone else was gone, we were only able to get Josue today. <laughs> but who else I'm do we single. need? We who else need do we need? Else. If we have Josue, who else do we need? Right? 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 Yeah. He's the expert in this. Yep. All right. So. Freedom. Sunday, e- no, I was gonna say Eagles. <laughs> Chiefs won the Super Bowl. Mister Kermit the Frog, <laughs> oh, coach. <yeah. laughs> I, they did it again. I'm trying to. The thing, I'm trying to think did about. You talk, how, did how you I talk did Kermit it. last episode or what? Uh, El- Elias was the one who mentioned it last episode <laughs> about Kermit. Yeah, that he sounds like Kermit the Frog. Really? Yeah. So, um, well, anyways, we have the expert himself All right. to talk us through the game all right obviously chiefs won but yeah we want me and Asia watched the last five minutes so that's <laughs> all we know about the whole game and Jose, take it from here tell so, us the whole game in general so the game started uh it started pretty fast uh eagles score first was it the eagles yeah I, yeah and then the the chiefs score again i was like wow like this is gonna be a not a <laughs> it's gonna be a score here score there a score. back and forth yeah uh-huh and uh and so one of the one of the worst things that can happen to you, especially in the Super Bowl, you know, big game and everything, mm-hmm. everyone's just looking at you. Um, Jalen Hurts, the quarterback for the Eagles, drops the ball. Oh wow. It's like the ball just goes out of his hand and it's like <laughs> I can't get it. Wow. And he gets knocked out and it's just like this one guy, I can't remember his name, he just it okay, usually those ball kind of like bounce to wherever they want to go they bounce weirdly huh dude that ball just bounced into his hand he (gasps) took it oh my god wow and i was like okay i guess the you know i guess the chiefs are gonna win but then the then the eagles came back and i was like whoa (laughs) i was like this is actually a pretty good game yeah and then you know the second half happened and then it's like whatever the Eagles had on they were because they were on top of the the Chiefs. It just mm-hmm. totally went away. <laughs> and then they got murdered. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah. <laughs> and then they got murdered. No, uh yeah, it was uh it was pretty good and and then um there was this one call. Like when it happened, mm-hmm. it's a holding call. Cause you know that receiver has to you have you gotta give him a chance to catch the ball in a way, kinda. Mm-hmm. But you have to block him. Yeah. But so the ref said that he was holding. Holding. Oh, <laughs> my god. Yeah. And it basically just like kind of like this. Yeah. I did see that. We saw, we saw yeah, that. And saw I was that like, this this is the moment. This is the the call that cost, cost the, the Eagles the game. And it did. And it did. Because yeah. after that, the, the Chiefs were like, you know what? We're just going to run the ball. Yeah. Eat that clock. Yeah. And the uh, Eagles... 
couldn't do anything. Didn't have any time. Yeah. It was over. How would yeah. that be called holding? Though? It didn't obstruct the other player at all. It's because he holding him from like the shirt. Like <laughs> it was like a light like, tug. Yeah, but still, like, but too much. Okay, now. like the in my opinion, it was not a holding call. No, but I guess you know the ref se vendió. Mm-hmm. He was on sale, and the Chiefs had them <laughs> had more money. <laughs> he was on sale. <laughs> the Chiefs offered more. Yeah, he Kermit, took it. Kermit That's the Frog so offered more. <laughs> That is so sad. <laughs> yeah, I can't. I can't do that again. We were, we were talking about that after about how la pasión. Yeah, la pasión. we saw. Okay, maybe it's different, right? But me and Asa were That's watching true. it, right? And um, obviously, the World Cup was barely like a few months ago, right? Yeah. And for us, it was like weird because we were like expecting everyone to be like, ah, you know, this big <laughs> celebration. But even like the players were just like walking, like nothing, like nothing had happened. You know, whereas, like, in the final of the World Cup, we even saw all the players start running. Some of them even started crying. <laughs> Messi dropped to the ground, like, all excited. I don't know if it's, like, just a different culture or if that's how they celebrate. Or no. I mean, were they really that good? They're like, oh, we're just going to win it. <laughs> and they no. were just like. Okay, so so this is. Okay, it would have been different mm-hmm. if the Eagles would have won. You would have seen more stuff like that. Because they, they weren't favorites, right? They were, like, underdogs or what? Well, they were kind of favored to win it all. Mm-hmm. But at the same time, you know, it's like the Chiefs are going to do it. Yeah. So the fact that they weren't unable to do that. And I don't know. I, I mean, honestly, it was it felt kind of bland mm-hmm. in the Chiefs winning. Maybe because I'm not a Chiefs fan. Mm-hmm. But it did feel kind of that way. Mm-hmm. And uh, I mean usually you don't see that kind of stuff yeah yeah i mean you, you see more people happy uh-huh. and tears and it's like ah well yeah. there was this one guy you can see his you know yeah he was like Tearing emotional oh, okay yeah but i was like yeah this feels kind of bland so even you as a nfl or american football fan like you you could tell that it was like yeah i mean very unpassionate in a way I mean, the the game was was good okay mm-hmm but it just the ending, it kind of felt a little anticlimactic. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, so. But yeah, I can kind of see what you're saying. Like, if the Eagles would have won it, I do feel like it would have been, especially because since. It would have been more emotional because, yeah. you know, it's it would have been, it's uh, it would have been their second win. Uh-huh. In, I didn't, last time was like 2017. Oh, so, yeah, that's right, yeah. So it would have been more, it, it wouldn't have more feeling. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. But the Chiefs winning, I'm not saying that the, their fans are not happy about it, because they are. Yeah, yeah. But it just doesn't feel like this is, you know. Yeah. Ah, yeah, yeah. You know, Super Bowl is like, ah. Yeah. You don't feel that. Yeah. I don't know. I just, it's over, and like, that's it. And uh, And for the Eagles, it's like, so uh, I kind of learned something today. It's like the most horrifying thing. Okay, so, you know, for a team, mm-hmm. you want to keep your people together for next season. Mm-hmm. Well, some of those, their coaches, like, took off. They're, they got hired oh, to wow. do other jobs, and it's like. Wow. And they have this huge list of uh, players that other, if they can't pay them, you what know, they're, they're going to go to, to other places. Wow. So that team's like. Yeah. Disassembling. Yeah. Eagles. Wow. Yeah, Eagles. That's sad. And for the, I mean, for for the uh, Chiefs, dude, basically, I bet half their people are going to be, like, together. Yeah. And they're just going to try replacing certain yeah. people and it, try to keep it better. Yeah. So, uh, the Chiefs are the new Patriots. They're the new evil. Wow. <laughs> that's yeah. a, that's a, could we say that's a bold take or? Is it just a reality? No, She's our new patriot. Yeah, yeah it's, it's it's just a reality. It's telling a reality. me about it. Pretty much like the the team that's like on a streak winning. Mm-hmm. Now they're hated. Yeah, because oh, they're okay. winning. Yeah, yeah. yeah makes sense. Winning. Makes sense. <laughs> I mean, Eliel didn't want them to win <laughs> simply because they had. The- yeah, and I mean, I didn't, I didn't want the the Eagles to win, but I rather choose the Eagles than the Chiefs. Yeah. 
That's yeah. weird, huh? <laughs> How that works. Yeah. Like, I don't want to know when, but I'd rather choose them than the other team. Yeah, yeah. And I'd rather have them win than the other team, but it's I don't want like them to said, win. Because, like he said, I don't know if you saw, but he said he'd rather say he lost to the Super Bowl winners oh, that, that too. than to the ones who lost, you know? Because if yeah. Eagles would have won the Dude, Super we Bowl. we lost to the losers. Yeah. <laughs> Niners lost to Eagles in okay. the, like the the semifinal. Oh, I guess you could call okay, it. Okay, okay, I know what you mean. Yeah, yeah. To, all right. In the NFC Championship. Yeah, yeah. 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 So that makes we sense. lost to the losers. Thanks yeah. a lot, losers. I mean, <laughs> that makes total sense. Como, como era? Fly Eagles. Oh, dude. <laughs> they they fly high and then they they flew, on fire. Yeah, they flew too high and uh, they crash and burn. Yeah, it's like sad. like that. Um, what's it called? the story or icarus what? icarus yeah, yeah i literally was thinking about he, that they flew too close to the sun and, and started melting his, yeah uh, wings started melting yeah and uh yeah. icarus i'm surprised you remember that i was i was thinking of it i was like i'm not gonna remember the name <laughs> yeah i don't know how but yeah yeah okay so is there anything else you wanted to say before we move on to this clip i have niners are coming back next year <laughs> okay actually yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> what <laughs> are your predictions like for the nfl in general like what do you think is going to happen like like you said eagles they're like disassembling so probably they're not going to do as good next year so it's kind of hard to like really predict because mm -hmm. there, there's a lot of pieces and anything can happen like as you know as that uh, injury happened in, in the yeah. niners that can like totally <laughs> you just yeah. you know season's over yeah as certain players get hurt yeah and uh i mean Obviously, I'm 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 hopeful for the future because mm -hmm. you know they got this rookie. Uh, well, he's gonna he's gonna be in his year two, uh, but Brock Purdy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then Trey Lance is gonna be good to go. So yeah, but yeah, it's happening. Yeah, this is our year. <laughs> oh, that's it for real. Oh, that's it for real. This year for real. I can feel it. <laughs> and then Trey Lance gets injured again. Please don't <laughs> put that in the universe. Yeah, yeah. We took it back. We took it back. We took it back. All right. Don't do that. What about Bills? This year, many people were saying they were the favorites to oh, win. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I remember that. So what do you think is going to happen with them next year? Are they just... What What happened to them? Like, what... <laughs> I, I think they lost... ceased to hear of them. They made it pretty far, no? Yeah, they did. But I I think that they're just going to try to regroup again and uh, keep trying the same thing, mm -hmm. which is not that that bad. I mean... They've been going to the playoff for like a, quite a few years now. Oh, okay. It's just, I don't, I think if they, you know, get a new uh, people on uh, offense, mm -hmm. uh, it'll help out more. Okay. But I think they're, they can like make it pretty far. Yeah. And then you got the Bengals, uh, oh, which yeah. it's another team that it, it's like on the fight right there. So, yeah. yeah. Honestly, the the t teams are they seem kind of dangerous. It's gonna be the Chiefs, mm -hmm. Bengals, and and the, the Bills. Mm. So they're gonna fight it out. Yeah, yeah. You Niners. Niners on the other side. You know the Cowboys seems like they're gonna start getting better. Oh yeah. Which is you know kind of sucks. <laughs> Cowboys. Uh, yeah, I I really dislike the Cowboys. Uh, but they're Cowboys. Know. <laughs> yeah but okay like most of, <laughs> most of their fans are like yeah we're america's team it's like dude okay cool like but Chill. they're like in your face it's yeah. like that's not cool man yeah. like, we don't want you to be america <laughs> wait, wait, wait 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 what what's going on here aren't you an original cowboys fan no that just happens because you know my mom they didn't want me to wear anything that seemed like I was a gang member. He showed me a picture where he's wearing a Oh, Cowboys yeah. Sweater. I saw that. <gasps> wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Tell me. I was that 2002? An OG Cowboys fan? Dude. What's going on here? I feel dirty. Just I'm going to have to tell all the Philadelphia. <laughs> oh, no, wait. Wait, what? San Francisco. <laughs> Philadelphia. I'm going to have to tell all San Francisco Niners fans. They're, they're gonna be like, "Did you burn it?" And I'll be like, "Yes, I did." Of I course, it with hate, <laughs> with, hate. <laughs> with profound hate. Yeah, yeah, embedded deep into my actions. I think that sweater went to hell. <laughs> <laughs> with all the rest of them, Dallas Cowboys. Oh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> <I'm just kidding. laughs> 
right. He said it. I didn't yeah, say yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Hey. Yo you, me lavo las manos. You told me to say it. <laughs> <laughs> I thought we agreed this before the, the What's episode. What's going on? Why are you guys turning on me? No. Okay. No. All right. I have the script right here. <laughs> <laughs> Just like the NFL. <laughs> no. Um. Yeah. I think the Niners are going to have a pretty good chance. <laughs> NFL scripted? Dang. Yeah. <laughs> That that that'd be crazy, you know. We found out later, just like WWE. Yeah. <laughs> it's like at the end, it's and like, and then the, the Chiefs are gonna win by a field goal. <laughs> I mean, it would make sense because the Simpsons are predicting everything. So, what if they have the script for the world? True. <laughs> the Simpsons is the script to oh! everything. They're the script. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Like they predicted uh, 9/11. Did you see that one? Yeah. And Trump. Trump being president. Yeah. <laughs> And also, there was a video of like uh, Homer in front of Trump <laughs> going down the escalator, and there's a. I think they made one. Um, that one they they made it later. Oh really? After? Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh! They're but, just yeah, kinda... they do. So they do. Oh ma- there's an gosh. episode donde they mention Trump. So Lisa becomes president, and she's like, "Oh, we just inherited this uh, deficit from uh, President Trump." Mm. <laughs> like we're we're massive in debt <laughs> <laughs> and guess what happened well you know cor- uh coronavirus yeah oh my yep. gosh and we became in debt. that's oh. okay all right go go go, go. now i'll just say that's crazy because they do a lot of these like simpsons things where like oh they predicted but are they literally making them as they come out like has these things happen in the world no it's just okay so because you just said that right. they made the that one Trump scene in yeah. The Simpsons after Trump was elected. No, right? yeah, I mean that one, but the one when they mention him as a as President Trump, that happened like I don't know, like back in two thousand eight or something. Oh, okay. So no, some of them are. It's just, real, it's just, I guess. So the I, what I heard is that they're just thinking, hey, like what kind of crazy stuff can we put on the show? <laughs> That's crazy, <laughs> and people actually and go then on it and happens. do it. Wow. Like that, the fish with three eyes. It oh happened. yeah, that's right. That's it right. happened. One of the uh, power plants in somewhere it was leaking, and then the fish had three eyes, and it's like, oh, dude, oh, <laughs> I didn't hear that. All right, but before we go more <laughs> off track, all right, yeah, that's we went, it. That's we went it. Went right? up the rails. Yeah, <laughs> before we go more off the rails, that's it. That's all you we had to say for NFL or the Super Bowl, right? Yeah, season's over, so um, you know, back to zero. Back to zero. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Next season in August. Pre-season. It starts in August. August preseason starts in August. And wow, they have like a pretty good break, huh? Yeah, I mean, so a lot of those players, uh, first of all, they want to heal up. If they need surgery or something for whatever, they do it right now. Mm-hmm. Um, they do take their breaks, and then they it slowly start building up. Uh. They do whatever they want to do right now. If they want to do like TVs or because mm-hmm. they some players do shows or yeah, something, yeah. they do that right now. It's like it's vacation. Like, yeah, and then their uh, spring tr- training. I think it it, st- it stars in like when is it like June or January something? in June? <laughs> yeah, it's, so they they start pr- spring training in June or something. Uh, okay. I think it's June, and it's just. It's more mostly workouts because they're preparing for yeah for uh for the season yeah yeah but it's not as intense as uh once they're actual in, practice starts. yeah oh okay all right well <laughs> so season's over people yeah you can go back into your novelas and stuff <laughs> to Champions League <laughs> I mean not novelas because I don't watch novelas <laughs> all right before we move on. There is a clip I want to show you guys of Elian. Now, for the OGs, <laughs> this is an old clip from episode 8, I believe, where he made a bold statement. Him and Daniel, actually, they made a bold statement about the Eagles. So let's play that clip real quick. Same thing with the Eagles. I think the Eagles the will Eagles follow. Are the like Eagles are still perfect. They're the per- only yeah, perfect team. 6-0. Yeah. and oh. Dang. But I think they're gonna fall off. Mm-hmm. They're not gonna go all the way. There's no way. Clip this. Clip so it. for when they win, Eagles fans, you guys are not even. You guys maybe will make the playoffs because you're already six and zero. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. 
We're not so going anywhere. Do it again. Do it again. Oh, okay. Yeah. Seriously. Sorry. Seriously. I, was, I was looking at the wrong camera. Yeah, Eagles fans, you're not going all the way. Not this year. Not with, I forgot their quarterback's name, Jalen Hurts. Nope. Not with him. I don't think so. So enjoy it while it lasts. Enjoy it right now. You're six and zero oh right much. now, but Yay. you can end up being like nine and <laughs> nine and six or something. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. If they win the Super Bowl, we're getting this clip. Nah, they're not winning the Super Bowl. They wouldn't even make it to the Super Bowl. Nah, oh, dang. They're, not, they're not winning the Super Bowl. All right. Yeah. That's a for sure, so. bro. That's right. a for sure. Not All the right. Eagles. Yeah. No. There's so many other teams yeah. that I think are way better. Mm. So. Yeah. All right, so what do you guys think of that clip? That is Wise actually, words from Eliel and Daniel, huh? That's pretty crazy because <laughs> first, true. the crazy part is that you said clip this. I know, bro. <laughs> clip I this. was thinking a hand, man. Are you a, a prophet? I, are you? I might be. Oh, that's crazy. Okay, <laughs> guys, Eliel specifically and Daniel. What happened? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Elias <laughs> said, maybe you'll make it to the playoffs. Oh, wow. They ended up going to the final. Almost winning, too. Yeah. Danny they, said they weren't going to... Even going to make it yeah. to the Super Bowl. Okay, remember uh, the first time that I was I started in the podcast? Mm -hmm. I said that Niners, they were going to play the Eagles in the NFC Championship. I think I, I remember. Yeah. I yeah. said that. Yeah. And they did, huh? Yeah. They did. That's and crazy. then we got murdered. <laughs> Acusalos con su mamá. Mama Eagle. Mama Eagle. Mama Eagle. No, she'll probably give me attitude. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my leg. <laughs> <laughs> my leg. All right, but yeah. Eliel, Danny, you guys were wrong all along about the Eagles. Wrong all along, you know. And I was the only one who was like, when they win the Super Bowl, we're going to... I said, when they win the Super Bowl. <laughs> That's crazy. I was close. I was closer than... You were so close. The, yeah, yeah. I was close. Dude, imagine. That I, 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 I didn't remember. Honestly, when we were talking about Super Bowl, I remembered something of a little saying something about the uh, Eagles. Okay. I never remembered me saying Did when they win the Super Bowl. So you had to go look through it? Through yeah. everyone? Yeah. Well, I remember... Mas or menos which one. Oh, okay. I was like, it's in the first... Uh, from five to ten, I remember uh, okay. some right. of those. Okay, but remember yeah. that I predicted that whoever uh, was gonna do the field goal at the end, that was the team that was gonna. Yeah, win. you said they were gonna win by a field goal too. Yeah, yeah, it's good. <laughs> His prediction is good. It's good. Yeah. You you said they would win by a field goal. Yeah, yeah. So did the guys that we interviewed. Remember? <laughs> or one they said they would win by three? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. One of one of the guys one we interviewed the said Chiefs would win by they three. Yeah. Win by uh, seventy, right? Oh yeah, that one girl 30. said seventy thirty. <laughs> oh yeah. Almost. <laughs> hey, it was close. It was thirty. Yeah, that's but right. thir thirty thirty five, thirty eight. Thirty. Golly. Yeah. All right. Well, that's been it for Super Super Bowl and NFL in general for yeah. now. We're not gonna talk about that anymore. Until next season. <laughs> until August. When Eliel and Danny will say something else that is totally wrong. And then I'll clip them again for the next Super Bowl. And then I'll, I'll predict uh, someone winning by a field goal. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now we'll move on to Rihanna's concert. The I didn't watch it. You didn't watch it? No. You didn't watch the halftime show? I didn't watch the halftime show. I, went, I always watch the halftime show just because it's like. Let's talk about the commercials. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't watch that either. I know. I watched the commercials. That were pretty yeah. Cool. Which one is the best commercial, do you think? Okay, my favorite one was that one with Will Ferrell. <laughs> I, I don't see know. It, no. I didn't watch any on Really? <laughs> I only watched the one with Clip John. Clip it, right here. <laughs> I'm just kidding. John <laughs> Travolta? Travolta? Oh, that's right, yeah. yeah. Oh, that one's pretty good, yeah. too. Yeah. He still looks pretty good. Yeah. He's like in his 60s. Está viejito. Está viejito, pero... Está viejito. He can, you... Está viejito, está vuelta. But yeah. All right, Will, the Will... Will Ferrell was pretty Will funny. Ferrell, yeah. He Will... did uh, some of the... Netflix shows? Oh, uh, okay. Did that uh Stranger Office Things? or what? Oh no, Stranger Things. <laughs> He's like, I'm Dustin. <laughs> I'm Dustin. <laughs> I'm they Dustin. have the same hair? Yeah. The same hair? Close. Yeah, close you're ruining close. the show. <laughs> All right. Yeah, that, that one's pretty funny. Yeah. All right. Rihanna's concert. Yeah. You didn't watch it? I didn't watch it. Did you watch it? Yeah. Yeah? I was very confused. <laughs> Why? <laughs> she was pregnant eh. no because well in the beginning she came out she came down right and yeah. uh, 
it looked kind of cool like she was flying and stuff yeah yeah and then uh she kept singing her old songs and i was like there's nothing else uh, and okay. then she went down and they were like dancing around yeah her. yeah and then <laughs> then she you know showed her belly and i was like oh i guess she's pregnant <laughs> i was like that's cool that's cool yeah and then you know she just did that again and <laughs> So when she went back on the platform, because uh -huh. I saw she had like a wire. Yeah. She, I was like, is she like tied up again? Because if I can't. <laughs> so I can't. La that, belly, la dude, belly, la that was like the first thing that came to mind. It's like, she's going to fall off. <laughs> she was like, does she have the wire? <laughs> I was like, she's going to get hurt. <laughs> and that thing would shake, bro. Like there's a close up where she's like stepping, like barely stepping. And the thing like moves, it, like oh, wobbles. Shoot. Yeah. So I bet she was scared, but I mean, she's she like, has to do what she has to do. She's like, my people are gonna fall. <laughs> <laughs> me too. My people will get hurt with me when the stage falls on them. <laughs> when the stage falls on yeah, them. Yeah, honestly, I was like, that's like the first thing that came to mind. It's like, Sebakaya, she's, like, she she's have gonna wire. fall off, man. Where's the wire? Because <laughs> I, you know, in the, when she came out, I saw it, that she was. Yeah. Up. Yeah. And I was like, oh, safety first. <laughs> yeah, safety first. Yeah. But after that, I was like, oh my God, is she is she going to fall yeah, off? Yeah, because she didn't put it Am back I going to see somebody get really yeah, hurt? Yeah. It's like they try to save the baby. So she's just tied up to her belly. She's like, oh, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> people were talking about it. <laughs> <I'm just kidding. laughs> people, people were talking about it. Like, they're, you know, they're making like a this, like, oh my God, she's pregnant. <laughs> like making a big deal out of it yeah and that's like dude she's pregnant so she's what she's pregnant so what <laughs> oh my gosh it's not, tell like, us, uh... it's not like you're gonna pay for the baby <laughs> <laughs> why are you pregnant <laughs> guys Ryan is pregnant oh my god well I mean uh, talking about the whole halftime show in general <laughs> I feel like it wasn't the best simply because she was pregnant so there's not much she could do you know uh, which uh, halftime show was actually really cool which one Ryan Gosling no <laughs> Katy no, Perry. Katy Perry. Yeah. Dude, she came in a lion. Like was, I don't remember, but yeah, I do remember some you, parts. You gotta watch it on yeah. YouTube. And like she came in the lion. She was like riding the lion. Yeah, 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 yeah. I remember. And that was cool. And I was like, heck yeah. yeah. And then the dancing sharks. <laughs> I don't remember everything, but yeah, I remember some. Bad bunny. That was that, that? he was a guest though. I was gonna say that. Uh, I remember that one still, simply though. because he was there. Yeah. With Shakira he, 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 and J Lo. J Lo, yeah. Yeah, Shakira and J Lo were the main ones. And then they brought uh, Bad Bunny and J Balvin as like guests to mm -hmm. perform with them. You know, after they, they interviewed Bad Bunny about the halftime show, and then he's like, so do you watch NFL at all? I'm like, no, <laughs> I performed the halftime show. I left and I never know who won the Super Bowl. <laughs> <laughs> that's crazy. Yeah. That's funny. Yeah. But at least he's honest, you know? El, yeah, that's true. But yeah. El Bad Bunny. El Bugs Bunny. I'm an old okay, Bugs Bunny. <laughs> Yeah. Has he said why he decided to choose that name? But oh uh, yeah, because es que es malo, and he had a conejo when he was a little kid. Close, and they killed it. And it's <laughs> really sad. It was like conejo malo, <laughs> <laughs> made into tacos. I uh, know he. Where Taco. is he from? Puerto Rico. Puerto right? Rico. Yeah. Yeah, they don't eat tacos over there. They eat mofongo. Mofongo. They made into yeah. mofongo. Un mofongo de conejo. Mofongo de conejo. <laughs> The bunny, <laughs> the bunny, the bunny. <laughs> All right, but uh, basically he chose that bunny because one day it was like Easter at school. He had to wear like a bunny costume, and he was mad that he had to wear a bunny costume. And they took a picture, and like he was looking back at the pictures. He saw the picture. He's like, "Oh, that looks like the bunny's mad, I'm bad bunny." You know, <laughs> that's crazy. Yeah, <laughs> basically just because of that. Okay. All right, but anyways, <laughs> Super Bowl <laughs> halftime show. Uh, yeah, Katy Perry. I know that one was like big. I remember Travis Scott simply because it was Travis Scott and I like his music. Who's that? Exactly. <laughs> no. Um, it's okay. I'm an elder millennial. Yeah, so true. I don't know who's that guy. He's the rapper. Who's who... that? Concert people tend to die or something? <laughs> what? Yeah, that one. Actually, yeah. <laughs> what? The, the the one who's the people at his concert. Yeah, I kind of remember that. Oh, one. where they died? Yeah. yeah my, I had a old friend from high school that went to that concert oh wow yeah he didn't die in, right in houston it was in houston yeah right? yeah because he's houston. from houston yeah <laughs> but i don't think he died i think they were like getting like severely injured maybe they did die. i think so i don't did die. i don't remember honestly but i yeah. heard bad things about it yeah yeah he did the super that, that's probably that's probably the only reason i remember that guy 
<laughs> because of the bad things. Yeah, because people get hurt in his concert, and then he's yeah. like, "Get him out of here!" Yeah. <laughs> Not because they want to help him out. He's like, he's, yeah, <laughs> you know, he's just he's getting hurt. He's making noises. Yeah, he's ruining the show. <laughs> my leg. <laughs> He's ruined my show. Michael it Jackson was... did a halftime show one time, didn't he? Yeah, that was Dude, a long time. Michael I don't. But even yeah, I don't. I don't remember that. I wish he was still alive. Yeah, that'd be awesome. He's the king of music. Oh, yeah. Hip. <laughs> so what was cool. his pop? Pop. Yeah, king of pop. All right, but yeah, Katy Perry is the one I remember. Pop. I remember Shakira and J Lo. Pop. They were the Latinas, you know, <laughs> representing the Latino community. So I'm like, Latinas. yeah, we have to support, you know. Uh, Travis Scott simply like because it. it was him. <laughs> um, and yeah, was like, Rihanna. Cool. Rihanna. Yeah. Rihanna's beautiful, by the way. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like on YouTube, it starts off like they show the whole half sign show, right? And I watched it because I wanted to talk about it. <laughs> like the first shot is like a, a closer from this. I'm like, dang, she's beautiful. You know, there's, I'm pretty sure it's fake, but there's something where it's like, so someone made like a picture of what a god would be depicted as and it looked like rihanna but i'm pretty sure it was fake <laughs> yeah it's probably a, yeah. a rihanna oh there's also a scandal from k-pop fans saying that rihanna the choreography for rihanna's halftime show uh was from they k-pop copied stolen? some moves they they stole some moves from bts i believe or really? some k-pop group yeah Dang. yeah that's crazy Dang. that's what i heard but yeah, i'm not I, sure I, about I that support dude K-pop at this more, point so that's my stuff <laughs> <laughs> You got to get an inspiration for whenever. Yeah. That's true. There's yeah. so much things taken, but props to whoever makes their own thing yeah. in this time. Because yeah. Because a lot of people copy. It's tough. Yeah. There's so many people that to be yourself is already hard. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, if you want to copy this show, it would be relative minds. Yeah. Related, <laughs> related minds. Related yeah. minds. Related Look, minds. Unrelated minds. This is, this is good. Yeah, because we're not we're being ourselves. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> we wanted to start a podcast not because other people are doing it. No, of course not. No, course not. because we wanted to do it. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Podcast. Anyways, anyway, anyway. Anywho. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Let, let's finish off halftime show half-time and show. then we can talk about okay. other stuff. All right. <laughs> Any other words? Well, you didn't watch it at all, so. Uh, Rihanna's I, pregnant. I, Rihanna's pregnant. Rihanna is cool. Um, she has good music. Like her music is iconic, honestly. Oh yeah, yeah, of course. Because like they would play her music, everyone knew it. Everyone knew it. I I know you said it's like the old stuff, but everyone knew it, man. <laughs> like who's not gonna know her songs? And then ASAP Rocky was supporting her. Uh, he's the. I don't think he's they're married. Dad. He's the. He's the baby father, daddy. Baby daddy. Yeah. It's a boyfriend. <laughs> he's a boyfriend. Yeah. Hey. Today's Valentine's Day. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> Josue, any last words about the halftime show? Oh, oh, I wasn't getting referring to that. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> I, I seem better. You seem better? I w- I'll say, it, you know, because it's Rihanna. I'll give it a seven. A seven? And she was pregnant too, so she couldn't do much. You don't know the pussy on the wire, so she could have fallen off, okay? <laughs> I mean, I wasn't really expecting that she was going to, like, dance crazy stuff. Yeah, yeah. But I don't know. I think I was expecting that there were gonna be someone like, su- like surprise, we got this other singer, uh, okay. and then like they're singing yeah, yeah. together. And, but yeah. no, and there were no lions coming. <laughs> <laughs> no lions. I think, it, uh, yeah, I agree with you. It, there's been better <laughs> halftime shows. Yeah, and um, I think mainly it was just the fact that she hasn't done music or performed in such a long time. Oh, really? That, yeah, I don't. That's why people were so hyped okay. about it. Because she announced it, like, in November or something like that. And people were super hyped about it because she hasn't performed or released music in quite a while. Wow. So that's why it was so hyped up. But okay. honestly, like, performance-wise, entertainment-wise, like, visual aspect, it wasn't that entertaining. I mean, I'm not going to be like, it was a wah, wah, wah. No. But it, it was better than, than that. Yeah, it, it, I mean. It, it was, was decent. It, it was, was decent. decent. Yeah. All right. Oh, yeah, yeah. You guys remember Maroon's Five's halftime show? Maroon I 5? remember something like that. It yeah. was so bad. Yeah. Well, I remember it being bad. Yeah. But it's funny because back then there would be halftime shows, and I'd, and like everyone was just waiting for the memes for after. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, for after the, yeah, I remember the Shakira one because at one point she went up to the camera, she was like, <laughs> <laughs> oh, "Yeah, yeah, that's great." <laughs> I'm like, "What happened?" <laughs> yeah. 
I remember that. Se emocionó. That. Yeah. <laughs> what was that? Well, you know, she's Colombiana, so. Yeah. Do they do that or what? Las parceritas. Probably. Bro, I love Colombian girls. I've said this before. Oh, yeah, but that's right. Colombian girls are beautiful. All right, anyways. <laughs> so is Rihanna. Uh, <laughs> anything else? women in general are beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> As long as they're breathing. elder millennial right here, wise words. You're our elder. He's wow. An elder. He's an elder millennial. All right, yeah. Honestly, for reals, any last words on halftime? No. Show or Super Bowl or anything? No. And if I really no, no. I think I'm good. Yeah. I said what I needed to say, and uh, yeah. Ready for next year. I'm ready for next year. All right. So that concludes <laughs> NFL uh, talk in general. Now, really quickly. We have like 10 minutes left. Cool. It's Valentine's Day. It is Valentine's Day. I think guys should also get flowers and chocolates on Valentine's Day. <laughs> Why are only girls expect to, expected to get flowers okay. and chocolates? From, I believe guys <laughs> are getting flowers and chocolates from their significant others. Yeah? From what I've seen. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I have friends that literally the their post is them receiving the the flowers and chocolates. The flowers and chocolates. Mm. Guy friends. Yeah. Dang. I I haven't seen that, so that's why I'm <laughs> okay, saying. Okay. Okay. I but think, oh, uh, wait, what? you know, go go go. No go go. Uh, I was just gonna say. I just feel like it's still like the majority is women getting the gifts. Okay. I not, I can, not guys. Yeah, I get that. That's mm-hmm. true. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And the guys always expected to do. And if the guy receives. It's the guy's money. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> For the married couples. Yeah, yeah. Like, here, I gave you 20 bucks. So you, got me so you can go buy me flowers. Hey, honey, I used your car to buy you all of these things. It came out to like $200. Uh, but it's surprise. okay. <laughs> hey, what is honey, the- we're, we're behind on the bill. <laughs> oh, God. I don't want you. Elder kidding. Millennial, <laughs> what is your opinion on Valentine's Day? It's, um... You overrated know. no it's, oh, it's okay it's a it's a holiday for uh love for <laughs> friendship for companies to remind you of uh <laughs> to that buy you need things. to spend stuff you to spend your, money on chocolate on, on your significant other because apparently like <laughs> you need to yeah on this day specifically yeah. like this day the other days whatever yeah. i mean the other days it doesn't matter you can be rude matter. and not buy anything but this Don't day buy anything. Buy it right you now. have to Go all out. Spend all your money. Spend that money on that chocolate, chocolate heart, the biggest teddy chocolate bear, roses, the big- biggest teddy bear. I mean, <laughs> you that bear is gonna be like right there in that corner, just like doing nothing. It's not even gonna fit in the room. Someone's it gonna hide in, in the there room. and scare you later. Like, come on, <laughs> for real. It's like, what is that called? Capitalism. Yeah, <laughs> that's called buying things, dude. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> Dude. Brah. That's what the companies Bra. want you to yeah. Bra. I mean if you buy it on another day, that'd be cool. Yeah. But today, yeah. come on, man. Like just today? Don't be like that. Yeah. Don't just spend money for your significant other so you can every give day, money to those companies. Yeah. Every day express love to your significant other, yeah. but just buy them things on Valentine's Day. <laughs> <laughs> Like, if, if you buy flowers for your significant other, like, on other occasions, like, oh, cool. like Nice. But, like, if it's, just today? Yeah, come on now. I mean, There's it's something like, going on there. Are they, just really, are they really your significant other if you're just... Oh, they just follow It's just trends, like Mother's right? Day. Are you only going to buy your mother yeah, right, on huh? that yeah. one day? Yeah. It's like every day. <laughs> every Mother's Day, Father's Day, I mean, Valentine's Day, Easter Day. I, I get it. I get it. The idea is that you're going to be like, yeah, you know, I have someone. And then you're going to rub it in other people's faces. Yeah, yeah. Thanks a lot, people. <laughs> <laughs> we have each other, guys, right? Oh, yeah. In Spanish, hey, is yes. el día de I amor have some y la things for you. Me too. Yeah. It's my heart. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's my love. <laughs> it's my love, it's guys. Gonna, I'm, I'm going to do like, como se llama? El Eugenio Derbez, like. Yo te doy todo, todo. Lo que me sobra. Todo lo que me sobra. Dame, dame. <laughs> like, I translated that for to a friend, and, and she was like, that is the weirdest thing. It's like, I'll give you everything, everything. <laughs> <laughs> That's leftover. <laughs> leftover. <laughs> Sad. It's like, puros leftovers. <laughs> puros leftovers. Sad. Recalentado. Days. <laughs> All right. 
But I'm not saying Valentine's is a bad holiday. I'm just saying Dang. it's just like Christmas, you know? Oh, yeah, that's Where right. You, it's capitalism. I just remember for, talking about that yeah. for Christmas. Yeah. 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 But yeah. Yeah. If you don't, guys, if you, if you don't, guys. <laughs> if you don't, guys, to love. <laughs> love to guys, love. Canon, um, love. Yes. <laughs> Wise words from ACO things. ACO things. <laughs> ACO things. Uh, I think the the best way to put it in uh this way you don't offend anyone. It's uh-huh. like dudes, your dudes just you know, do 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 do. Oh ACO things. What? <laughs> what? <I'm just> <laughs> we had the same reaction at the same time. Like, what? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just All kidding. Right, okay, no no. What I was trying to say is what was I trying to say? What did I say? <laughs> things. <laughs> Thing. This, oh yeah if this you guys or girls <laughs> don't have a valentine's we'll be your valentine <laughs> oh, unrelated <laughs> minds as a whole oh, unrelated minds as, as a, a whole, whole will be your valentine yes so please give us chocolates <laughs> and we'll give you some once you give us some chocolates i, I like, I like hershey's okay yeah. <laughs> Sorry, what, what do you like i like twix and kit kats <laughs> cool twix more i like ferrero Rocher. those are good yeah. oh lindor Oh yeah, oh, those are, Damn, those are you guys nice. are like fancy chocolates, dude. I love cho- I love chocolates like my favorite type so, of like sweet. Let's see, uh, ¿cómo se llama Ferrero? Yeah. So yeah. that one's like I think about fifteen dollars at Costco. Yeah. You get certain a uh, good amount of them, yeah, um, okay. but it's worth it. Honestly. Those are they're I f- good. I can eat one, and if I feel like it's there's like too much already because they're mm. powerful. Yeah. I think they're like that twenty. 24 20 set or something oh, okay, it's something yeah. like that 20 pack. yeah have like, you ever eaten uh orange chocolate <laughs> huh it's good it's like some of the best chocolate i've ever tried hmm. did you try chocolate when you went to spain no i tried oh where was it it's switzerland i think they're oh, famous for oh, chocolate yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah i went to like one of have their, you tried cho- their hot chocolate no <laughs> i tried their chocolate too but their chocolate they had like a whole store just of chocolate and like all different types it was cool Thing. I brought some back actually. <gasps> he did. Just have some? No, bro. He just ate it. No, you yeah. do. I told you. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> but yeah. Check his pockets. <laughs> They're empty, brother. Empty. He lies. No he has one. like a necklace where he has like the last one yeah. on there and he just licks it sometimes. <laughs> to keep Each that. day. <laughs> just one lick today one lick. as we told him more. Damn one bro. lick. <laughs> All right, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Fa- final thoughts on Valentine's Day. Valentine. Valentine's, Valentine's Day is a day of love and expression. And friendships. Friendships. Dia del amor y la amistad. Dia de amor y la amistad. But don't let it be just the only day. Exactly. Sure, of course, take this time to actually go and buy some things. Like, of course, like they have <laughs> what selections is it with, everywhere. With buying stuff. But can you just spend time with people? No. True. That's every true. day. Oh, that's Christmas. But why not take <laughs> advantage Christmas. of all these things that are in the store and giving it? It's because they're on discount but, today. But being... <laughs> I think discount it. is tomorrow, dude. Oh, it is? Oh, they're on discount tomorrow. E. <laughs> Let's be rebels and buy stuff yeah. for Valentine's Let's tomorrow instead. <laughs> belated Valentine's Day. Belated. Hey. Let's ce- celebrate that because everything's cheaper. Yeah. <laughs> belated Valentine's Day. Because if you're on a budget, come on now. Yeah. Consider your budget and be like, <laughs> I, I can celebrate money. it the next day. You don't have to follow <laughs> yeah, everyone trends. else. Yeah, don't follow trends. Don't just be yourself and <laughs> do what's best for you. <laughs> People are gonna hate us. That that kind of sounds like Valentine's Day's times. Valentine's Day's times. That kind of sounds like when uh when people are like, yeah, I'm not gonna buy stuff on Christmas. We're gonna celebrate Christmas in July. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, Fourth See? of July and Christmas Day. There it's the best. Fourth of July is gonna be on Christmas, and Christmas is gonna be. On We're 4th changing of July. all the holidays, guys. We're making unrelated Today holidays. Is, <gasps> Today is unrelated Valentine's Day. Unrelated day. Unrelated tomorrow, day. Tomorrow, tomorrow. Because everything's cheaper. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Unrelated day. So yeah. is it going to be after every holiday? Is like the next day? It's well, yeah. It's like, uh, so Halloween costumes, you know, they're like really expensive. Buy them <laughs> after <laughs> Halloween. Yeah, dude, on the next day after Halloween, yeah. I seen them at uh, Walmart for like a dollar. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's like, does Walmart <laughs> when the when they don't need this stuff. Yeah. They're just like, get rid of it. Yeah. How much you want this? A dollar. Just sell it for a dollar. Just take it. Take it. Two for one. <laughs> Two for a nickel. <laughs> when when we're rich, we're going to change the unrelated day to before the actual holiday. So now we can spend the actual... I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> we're going to buy a real, real money? Is it we'll real money? We'll pay extra. <laughs> for everything. 
Uh, and I would be the day before. Yeah, we'll buy you, out are everything. Are you gonna and finally give day, tips? Nothing. You're gonna finally give tips. Um, yeah. I'll take their money. I'll take their tips. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Get the tip jar. <laughs> That's mine. Thank you. This is unrelated day. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Jose. Last opinions on Valentine's Day. Oh, uh, you know, it seems like a nice holiday for friendly people, couples, and stuff like yeah. that. But you do feel kind of forced to uh, buy stuff. Yeah. I mean, I'm single, so whatever. <laughs> I don't have hey, to worry. I don't have us, to worry about that. Buy us some things. Chocolate? It's fr- it's fr- buy me some Twix. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm gonna give you everything. Everything. Give me leftover. Give me some guy leftover. <laughs> Do I take leftover pupusas? I don't. Do. <laughs> the it's the magic word. The queso, the please, queso. with some repollo and some salsa. Tienes hambre, verdad? <laughs> For pupusas, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, my mom made some last week. Uh, I was like, "Thank you, Jesus, for this, <laughs> for this beautiful <laughs> blessing, blessing right here." <laughs> I'm this like, part. "I'm gracias a Dios que I'm Salvadorian." <laughs> Dang, dude, were it's you born in Salvador? Yeah, dude. <gasps> That's cool. Man. We got an OG Salvadorian right here. <laughs> OG Salvadorian. <laughs> Don't tell people. How are you? Uh, then they're like, "Oh my God, he's Salvadorian." Oh, okay. he's dangerous and stuff. My, my, <laughs> he's dangerous. My and cousin. I'm like, hi, hi. <laughs> You're so hi. undangerous. Hi. My cousins, please don't hurt me. <laughs> my cousins are Salvadorians, and they're savages. and they're and they're Mexicans at this like mix. Oh, dude, and that my makes cousin, them dangerous. My cousin, <laughs> my cousin calls them pupusas de carne asada. Pupusas de carne asada. Because you know los tacos de carne. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> all right. Well, we're out of time. Valentine's. <laughs> Any last words at all about anything? Mm, Valentine's Day, days of Valentine's. What did I say? If you know guys? <laughs> if you guys know Valentine's Day times. <laughs> yeah. Also, any last words? Um, yeah. Love your friends and your significant other. Yeah. Rock and roll. Yeah. <laughs> hey, you can't say that because you're not a rock star. If you... You don't know that. If you... If you <laughs> If you I have a piano on my phone known where that, I can piano out on you. <laughs> Unless you're a rock star, you can say that you're a rock star. I am a rock star. <laughs> Can't say that. You're not a rock star. Because I did this. <laughs> because I did that automatically makes him a rock star. Rock and roll. All right, all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, fine. Yeah, As it, the elder millennial, I'll forgive you. <laughs> As the younger yeah, As the younger ACO. <laughs> I don't accept your forgiveness. Oh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> you can't do that. She's the elder millennial. You're right. Hey, elder. This, this, this is uh, this is the reason why uh, this country is going because <laughs> they don't you listen to, to me, elder This is because the they don't listen. <laughs> this right here. They don't listen. This is yeah. the reason the world is the way it is. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Unemployment's high. Hey. Uh, <laughs> hey, we're, we're choosing to be. <laughs> choosing to be unemployed yeah. like whatever happened to working we okay. are working Wait, this you're, work? you're referring to the work that you get paid we're not getting paid <laughs> we're doing this because it's our vocation yeah Shh. all right yeah yeah before before we keep going <laughs> any last words for real <laughs> oh <I'm just> kidding. <laughs> any last words for real no yeah yeah Jose? yeah i'm yeah? good all right i told them whatever they wanted that you hear okay <laughs> like if if they're like ACL, they won't take it in, but the smart people will take it in, right? Yeah. <laughs> you know, take yeah. care of each other. Yeah. Amen. Amen. All right. That's been it from Unrelated Minds. Thank you guys for tuning in. Uh, it was a good NFL season. Uh, now Champions League is up. Uh, Bayern beat PSG this week uh, and um, Milan beat Tottenham just really quickly. Um, that's been it from us. Thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you guys next week. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>